More than 800 WKU students have registered to vote during this fall semester. An effort is underway to encourage political engagement, and it's clear WKU students are getting on the bus. on campus seem to be reliving to some degree the 60s and the 70s, so we thought that maybe that would be uh, a good thing to go with. The civil rights movement, anti-war protest, political activism from the last 40 years immortalized on this bus. It's a great opportunity for students to, to look back and see how students of other eras became involved in the political process. Today, students are also getting involved, many paying close attention to the two men hoping to become our next president. The campaigns themselves, the presidential candidates especially, are speaking to and addressing issues of concern to young people, and they've, uh, they've uh, reacted to that in a very positive way. The political engagement project going on this semester has included events like Debate Watch 08, a mock election, and voter registration drives. We have told students, uh, told them that these are the issues that concern you. It's young people that are fighting the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. You are the ones that are, are impacted by the high cost of living, tuition, college tuition, high price of gas. And with the country set to elect either the first African-American president or the first female vice president, students are ready to make their mark on history. These are monumental times, and I think the students do realize the significance of, uh, significance of that. Nearly 2,300 people attended this week's Debate Watch event at Diddle Arena. Awareness activities are planned throughout the rest of the semester. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.